Hi friends, it's Miss Graham here. Today we're going to read Brown Bear, Brown Bear, What Do You See? And then we're going to do a, a graphing activity using M&Ms. Are you ready to get started? This is Brown Bear, Brown Bear, Graphing Activity by Mrs. Graham. So our vocabulary for this um, activity is going to be our colors. So we have red, orange, yellow, green, blue, white, black. <clears throat> Some of our vocabulary words are graph, and you're gonna see what a graph looks like today. And then we're going to talk about columns and rows. For the graphing activity, some of the items that you will need are regular M&Ms. We're going to use brown, red, yellow, blue, green, um, not purple, excuse me, and orange. You can find this print with brown bear, brown bear graph um, from this website right, right here. One plus one plus one equals one dot net. Today we're going to read the story, Brown Bear, Brown Bear, What Do You See? by Bill Martin Jr. and illustrated by Eric Carl. This is the front cover. This is your spine. This is the back cover. I'm going to flip it over and we're going to start with the front cover. Brown Bear, Brown Bear, what do you see? The author is Bill Martin Jr. and it's illustrated by Eric Carl. Brown Bear, Brown Bear, what do you see? I see a red bird looking at me. Red bird, red bird, what do you see? I see a yellow duck looking at me. Yellow duck, yellow duck, what do you see? I see a blue horse looking at me. Blue horse, blue horse, what do you see? I see a green frog looking at me. Green frog, green frog, what do you see? I see a purple cat looking at me. Purple cat, purple cat, what do you see? I see a white dog looking at me. White dog, white dog, what do you see? I see a black sheep looking at me. Black sheep, black sheep, what do you see? I see a goldfish looking at me. Goldfish, goldfish, what do you see? I see a teacher looking at me. Teacher, teacher, what do you see? I see children looking at me. Children, children, what do you see? We see a brown bear, a red bird, a yellow duck, a blue horse, a green frog, a purple cat, a white dog, a black sheep, a goldfish, and a teacher looking at us. That's what we see. The end. I just love that book. Now we're going to um, graph our M&Ms. For this activity, we are going to do M&M sorting. And you will have to forgive me because <clears throat> My animal's down here printed in funny colors. I think my printer might be out of ink. So I put the M&Ms that correspond with that animal at the bottom there for you to see. Let's get started. So we're gonna take our M&Ms, just of the regular kind, and we're gonna see what I have. So here in my hand, I have some yellow, red, blue, orange, green, and brown. So I'm just going to take these M&Ms and I'm going to put them 
one M&M &M goes into each square. So one yellow, two yellow, three yellow. And I have one green, two green. One, two orange, one red, and two brown. Let's do it one more time. I just went ahead and took out all the broken ones. So I have two brown, some green, oops, and I have three more yellow to add. And we're gonna add blues under the black, even though it's not a blue sheep, it's a black sheep. Two more oranges. And one more red. So this is called a <clears throat> graph. And the ones that go up and down, these are called columns. And the ones that go side to side, are called rows. So now that we've sorted our um, M&Ms by colors and put them into groups, we can count them. So we can easily look at this and see how many yellow ducks we have. We have one, two, three, four, five, six. Six yellow ducks. Let's count our green frogs. One, two, three, four, five. We have five green frogs. How many blue sheep do we have? One, two, two blue sheep. How many red birds? One, two, two red birds. Let's count our brown bears. One, two, three, four four brown bears and our goldfish one two three four four goldfish and remember we're not counting these because these represent our animals up here so which one has the most the most is a lot and just by looking with my eyes, I can see that the yellow duck is the tallest. So he has the most. And the least is who has the less amount. And it looks like from my graph, I can see here that we have a tie or they're equal or they're the same. And that would be the red bird and our pretend blue sheep here. They have the least amount in the graph. Good job, my friends. And my favorite part of this activity is that you get to eat the M&Ms when you're all finished. Thanks for hanging out with me today, friends.